Megan Kosey is skeptical her 12-year-old son won't be in the classroom as many days as she hoped based on elementary school closures and the lack of staff for in-person learning at Hamilton Grange Middle School. Remote learning has been a serious challenge for her straight-A 7th grader. We noticed that his math grade was down in the 70s and he was always a straight-A student. And then we so we started contacting teachers and then come to find out he doesn't go into any of his live Zoom. And then Megan's Wi-Fi dropped out during our interview. The same thing happens to her son Leo during virtual classes, forcing him to sit at a nearby diner or use his mom's phone. Megan called me on the phone to let me know this is their reality, advocating to keep schools open. Of the 471 middle schools, we fully expect that half will be able to open their doors uh, on the on the 25th, offering uh, five day a week instruction to their students. On Thursday, February 25th, out of 196,000 students, 62,000 sixth through eighth graders will return to the classroom. Teachers will go back the day before to prepare. Prioritizing in-person staff returning to work for vaccine access at city hubs from February 12th through the 21st and over midwinter recess. But not all teachers have been able to get appointments for their first shot, let alone complete a second dose to be effective. 39,000 teachers currently have medical accommodations through June. I, I do have some trepidation to it a little bit because of the, you know, the chances of catching COVID. Layton Hall is a sixth grade teacher in the Bronx who will return to the classroom to teach students face to face, which he says will be another adjustment. 70% of New York City public school students have chosen to be at home remote learning for the past year. For some students, they would have been fully remote for a year and a half. So maybe even having some online orientation or some way to kind of slowly get kids on board. I think it makes sense. While the mayor is already promising a five day a week opening for the fall, the chancellor is leaving the door open for a remote learning component.